Hey Spartans! On my last video I mentioned not buying cheap eye protection and I've had a couple of people ask me what I recommend. So I've put together my top 5 favourite eye protection, especially for those who need to wear glasses underneath. Anyone who knows me knows that I need to wear glasses under my goggles and I absolutely hate contact lenses. As a result, I have been through a lot of various different options that are known to be useful for glasses wearers. When looking for eye protection, the minimum thing I want to see before I make a purchase is their safety standard rating. Here are the three to look for when making your purchase. Usually, the two that you want to look for are ANSI Z87.1 this is the American Standard Safety Rating or the EN166F this is a European Standard Safety Rating you may also see MIL-PRF which are Military Combat Eye Protection Standard Ratings they're fine too but they're a lot less common sometimes on resellers like Amazon or Airsoft sites they may not include this in the description Find the eye protection manufacturer's website and you will 9 times out of 10 see the details on their listing instead. I will clarify, this is my personal opinion based on the experience and research I've done personally. People's preferences are subjective, so I'd love to hear your recommendations in the comments below about what's worked for you. I also want to clarify, I'm not sponsored and I'm not making any money from making this video. This is just my personal view and recommendations for fellow airsofters like you. Number 5. Guard Dogs Evader 2. These are a polycarbonate ANSI Z87.1 safety rated goggles that fit comfortably over small to medium sized glasses. I say medium as they are advertised as fitting over small to large glasses but they felt tight over my larger frame glasses and pushed them into my face. This resulted in mist and sweat fogging up my glasses and goggles. Worn with smaller frames or none at all and these become a very breathable and an excellent contender when picking your eye protection, especially as they boast a reasonable price of £30. Number 4. ESS Land Ops Goggles Lots of the ESS models are a common choice for airsofters. I read that they are the only goggles authorised by the US Army for use over prescription glasses. This in my opinion bodes well as an over the top goggle. As you can imagine though, being military used, these lenses have a very high V50 impact rating. This is well beyond the ANSI Z87.1 standards that we're looking for to keep your eyes safe. One of the issues that causes fogging up, this reaction causes that dreaded mist inside your goggles, leaving you blind in the middle of a game field. This isn't a problem for the ESS though, as they have great ventilation and a clear zone lens coating that is meant to keep them from fogging up. The only drawback I found with this is any glasses over 5.5 inches wide is a bit of a squeeze under the goggles and presses your frames into your temples, which can be slightly uncomfortable throughout the day. So make sure that you measure your glasses before making a purchase. The price of these goggles range between £55 and £75, depending on what colour and shade you go for, which is pretty reasonable to be fair. And for that reason, this is why they are ranked 4 on my top 5. Number 3. Dye I4 Paintball Mask. The full face mask that really needs no introduction, the Dye I4. This mask is heavily used by airsofters and paintballers alike. There is a wide variety of different colours, designs, patterns, camos that you can choose from. I especially like the blue UV lenses with them. They boast a thermal lens which pretty much eliminates all fogging issues in most weathers. They are known for great breathability and when communicating with your team there's no issues with your voice travelling to them as other full face masks are known to muffle you. The bottom of the mask is quite short and flexible so aiming down your sight is fairly easy to do with these. This is a bit of a double edged sword however as with some people the bottom of your jaw can slightly be exposed. Whilst a great mask, they did not fit my glasses well and they felt a little bit tight on my frames, although I've got friends that use these masks that also have glasses and feel that they're very comfortable, although my glasses are slightly more on the larger side than theirs. The safety rating, which is the point that we really want to be looking at here guys, is ANSI Z87.1, so absolutely fine for your use on the airsoft or paintball fields. 
Dye also comes with a pretty large price tag of £130. If you are a non-glasses wearer, this is a great mask to choose, but can sometimes be a little pricey for some. Number 2. Revision Bullet Ants The bullet ants are sported by the British Armed Forces for a variety of safety uses, both in combat and engineering roles. They have three interchangeable lenses, yellow, black and clear, to suit all environments and have fantastic ventilation. I tore the top phone out of mine as well for extra ventilation. Due to the full eye seal, they don't have the space for glasses underneath, but instead come with a lens adapter that clips inside. You can get lenses for them, made up sometimes even for free at most opticians. Where previously the guard dogs would cause steaming up, these never did and the vents on the top kept cool air flowing through the lenses at all times. Safety is also not a concern, as this exceeded the US military ballistic impact requirements, the ANSI Z87.1 ballistic impact requirements and the EN 166, 170 and 172 requirements. Your eyes really couldn't be in safer hands. Whilst the linked ones I have included in the description are slightly higher, at £70, you can usually pick these up from surplus stores or on eBay for a bargain of £30. I highly, highly recommend these goggles. Number 1. The V-Force Grill The grill, whilst used predominantly in paintball, has taken the airsoft community by storm. With a fantastic peripheral vision, thermal lenses, comfortable straps and lots of room for large glasses underneath, this is a top contender for my choice of eye protection. Sometimes when playing in climates like the UK, towards later in the day with bad overcloud, the vision can become quite limited. When this happens, my snazzy tinted lenses start to affect my vision. However, with the click of literally two firm buttons on the side, the lenses unbuckle and they slide out easily. Then my clear lens can swap straight in and I'm back in the action. There really aren't many goggles or masks where this takes less than three to four minutes to do. So safety again is an ANSI Z87.1 and the price is a very humble £91. Or if you want some of the fancier styles, a little bit more. These are absolutely my favourite ones to wear on the field. I also enjoy the V-Force Profiler, although these are less common and harder to get hold of these days. Well that wraps up my recommendations of airsoft eye protection. If you've enjoyed this video, please drop me a like, subscribe and leave a comment on what you'd like to see next. Orange Spartan, over and out.